Start this morning with an update to a story we first brought you over the weekend. A man who was shot in Craven County has been identified. Investigators say it happened on Sunday just before 5 o'clock on Wilmar Road in Vanceboro. Police say Chad Ipoke has been shot. They say he was in a confrontation with Billy Davenport. IPOC was taken to Vidat Medical Center for surgery, and as a result of his injuries, he had to have his leg amputated. The investigation has been turned over to the district attorney for review. Police in Jacksonville say 17 people have been arrested as part of what they're calling Operation Nightmare Before Christmas. Seven people are still wanted this morning. The operation was the result of nearly a year-long investigation to crack down on drug-related crime in and around Onslow County. For a full list of the arrests and the charges, you can visit our website, WNCT.com. In news across North Carolina, according to a new report published by the U.S. Centers for Disease Control, the statewide opioid epidemic has gotten worse. Between 2016 and 2017, the CDC said that there was a 45.2% increase in death across America from things like illegal versions of the drug fentanyl. Drug overdoses increased in all but 15 states, with North Carolina having the highest increase along with Arizona and Oregon.